which of the following is not the possible product of dehydration of the given alcohol in acidic medium student as we all know that dehydration in acidic medium occurs via carbocation intermediate so students let's find out the products formed during the dehydration of the given alcohol in acidic medium first the given alcohol is this when this reacts with acid water will be eliminated and the carbocation will be formed so student now the products formed after elimination is this or the h plus could have been removed from this carbon so the product can be this students also this 2 degree carbocation will be able to rearrange itself to a 3 degree carbocation after rearrangement the carbocation formed will be this so alkene formed with this carbocation can be this so it is very clear that option number 1 is formed number 2 is formed number 3 is not formed and option number 4 is also formed in the product that means the correct answer is option number 3 moving to the next question students which is question number 67 consider the following reaction sequence student in this question we are given with the sequence of reactions and we have to identify the final product z so let's start the reaction starting with propane one all which is alcohol with three carbon atoms when this reacts with socl2 which is thionyl chloride oh is substituted with cl this is x when this is heated with alcoholic koh the product obtained is y which is an alkene this when reacts with b2h6 thf and then h2o2 in basic medium the product obtained is an alcohol in which the addition of water molecule has taken place according to anti markovnikov rule that means the final product z is represented in option number 2 this is propane one all so in this reaction the final product is same as that of the reactant that means the correct answer is option number 2 moving to the next question students which is 68 which of the following compounds reacts with sodium bicarbonate so student we need to know that the acids which are more acidic than carbonic acid will react with sodium hydrogen carbonate i am writing the acidic order of the given compounds and that of carbonic acid so order of acidic strength is among the given compounds picric acid is most acidic then we have carbonic acid which is h2co3 and then we have phenol that means phenol is less acidic than carbonic acid then we have ethanol and least acidic among the given compounds will be acetylene so only picric acid will react with sodium hydrogen carbonate since it is more acidic than carbonic acid so i'm writing the reaction picric acid is 2 4 6 trinitrophenol when this reacts with sodium hydrogen carbonate which is nah co3 the compound so formed is 246 trinitro sodium phenoxide plus h2o plus co2 that means the correct answer is option number 4 moving to the next question students which is 69 william sun synthesis cannot be used for the synthesis of student first of all i'm writing the general reaction that is used in william sun synthesis is r o n a plus r x 
O minus will back attack on this R and the product so formed is ether. Let's mark this R as R dash just to differentiate and the side product is Na x so student this r cannot be a benzene ring because in case this r is a benzene ring or a phenyl the cx bond will have partial double bond character and bond will be difficult to cleave on the other end this r can be aromatic or can be a benzene ring or can be an aliphatic carbon chain so the only ether which cannot be synthesized using Williamson synthesis method is a diphenyl ether because in this case the CX bond of the aryl halide will not break as a result there will be no reaction when sodium phenoxide reacts with aryl halide on the other hand rest ethers can be synthesized using Williamson synthesis method so the correct answer is option number one moving to the next question students which is question number 70 Boiling points of aldehydes and ketones are higher than that of ethers of comparable molar masses due to. Student, as we all know that boiling point depends upon the intermolecular interaction. Also, we know that aldehydes and ketones are more polar than ethers, which ultimately results in stronger dipole-dipole interaction in aldehydes and ketones. As a result, aldehydes and ketones higher boiling point than that of ethers that means the correct answer is option number three that means boiling points of aldehydes and ketones are higher than that of ethers of comparable molar masses due to strong dipole dipole interaction in aldehydes and ketones than in ethers so the correct answer is option number three moving to the next question students which is 71 